Hello, this is Angelia with today's Bible reading. Today's reading comes from Revelation 3, Message to Laodicea. To the angel of the church of Laodicea, write, The Amen, the faithful and the true witness, the beginning of the creation of God says this. Of course, that's talking about Jesus. I know your deeds that you are neither cold nor hot. I wish that you were cold or hot. So, you know, what he's saying is um, they're neither uh, against him or working for him. And, you know, he wishes they were one or the other. So because you are lukewarm and neither hot nor cold, I will spit you out of my mouth. So, you know, um, if you're not for him actively or against him actively he don't want nothing to do with you why why would he because you say I am rich and have become wealthy and have need of nothing and you do not know that you are wretched and miserable and poor and blind and naked I advise you to buy from me gold refined by fire so that you may become rich and white garments so that you may clothe yourself um, so what he's saying is if you're doing uh, life for the love of money uh, then uh, you are wretched because that means you can't you know worship God and mammon both uh, and you're gonna end up in the wrong side you know because um, that's not what God wants from you you ain't supposed to chase the almighty book you're supposed to put on to be like Jesus shoes and walk in those. <clears throat> so, yeah, no, he's saying to get from him gold. It's never going to perish, and that's your salvation. Um, and he's going to give you a white garment to wear. So, you know, you're going to clothe yourself. And that the shame of your nakedness will not be revealed. And in this case, uh, I believe that's a metaphor for uh, your lack of, you know, work at you know the salvation that you supposedly accepted and I salve to anoint your eyes so that you may see so you know he's letting you know um you're not you're not getting the point um <laughs> you know if um, this is what you're doing if you are riding the middle ground worshiping the almighty buck then you kind of blind <laughs> to what's important those whom I love I reprove and discipline so you know if uh, the world is giving you a little smack maybe you need to pay attention to that and say why what is going on that you know might not be quite right and you know sometimes you need to just stop drop and pray <laughs> you know <laughs> I stand at the door and knock if anyone hears my voice and opens the door I will come into him and will dine with him and he with me and like I said we've all seen the memes and the you know pictures of Jesus knocking on the door I have a picture you know in my living room of Jesus knocking on the door um, and you know that's definitely a good thing to let him in he who overcomes I will grant to him to sit down with me on my throne and I also overcame and sat down with my father on his throne so he's letting you know you're gonna have a place you know in heaven if you overcome the world and you know uh, stay steadfast in your salvation and you get to be with him he who has an ear let him hear what the Spirit says to the churches and to us you know because this was written to this church but also to us to see in later days so that's his uh, message to Laodicea and also to us um, amen uh, please like and share this word so we can spread it around the world uh, if you want to help me out, subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you want to help me out even more, go to my Patreon page and become a patron. That's all for now. Until next time.